Hello everybody, I'm Dudley Pleasant, better known as the Bottle Tree Man, right here in Greenwood, Mississippi. We've noticed on Sunday afternoon, a lot of people are cooking in the city. So we started, we decided to ride around and just find out what everybody was cooking. Okay, let's go see what we can find. Cooking burgers. <laughs> okay, here we are. I picked up a scent and I'm moving in on it. They're almost ready. Like Hamburgers. Three people. Three burgers. Popular, popular, popular thing to cook, okay. What kind of... Uh, it's county market. Ground beef. beef. Not the ground chuck, it's fatty. Got any yeah. secret seasoning on yes, it? Yes, I got secret seasoning Not inside the meat. Anything that you want to indulge and let us know about? Well, I got special buns today. Special Shirley. buns. Special buns today. Special buns. Uh, store bought, and mm -hmm. we ain't had them before. Mm -hmm. We're gonna... So the secret's in the bun? Secret's in the bun today. Secret's in the bun. Okay, okay. Hey ladies, have uh, have y'all smelled anything cooking today while you're out walking? Nope. Nope, nope. Okay, well, appreciate your time. We're moving on. We're just trying to smell something cooking. Okay, y'all, we picked up another scent. We're moving in on it. Let's see what we have cooking over here. Are you a video hey girls. Hi, <laughs> okay, let's see here. What do we have? What are you cooking? Hot dogs? Are you uh, on hamburgers. <laughs> okay, baked potatoes. Okay. What do we have over here? What are you cooking now? What is what is that? Quail. Quail? Okay. Hey, quail. Are you putting this on YouTube? Mm -hmm. Okay. Any uh, secret sauces that's going on there? No. No? Oh, you got to have tell. something. You can't tell. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Okay, well, boy, hey, hey, it all smells good. Okay, well, we're moving on. Okay, y'all, we smell another barbecue pit. Let's see what we got going on over here. Oh, man. Look at him. Look at him. We looked up. We looked up. Okay, what we got going on here? We look like some chicken. Oh. Um, little chicken for the family. Man. Chicken. And what else, what else we got over there? We just got chicken for the family. Chicken? This chicken is, all the way around? Just warming the grill up for next weekend. Chicken. Okay, now what's going on next weekend? Next weekend we're having a barbecue cooking contest. Okay, barbecue contest. Is that downtown? That's downtown. What is that, Rivers to the Rail? Something like it. There's, yeah. There's some, there's yeah. some no name bands playing. I um, know, those wannabes, you know. I used to be a wannabe. <laughs> okay, any kind, what, what's your secret spices well, you got? I can't give you all my secrets. I got you. Did you, what's your granddaddy come over there with the boat, on the boat with this recipe yeah, or something? Yeah, something like that. Something like that. Something like that. Okay. We're just going to get this all turned around here. Okay, boy, that looks good. Okay, guys, we're moving on. Okay, y'all, I picked up another scent. It's kind of fishy smell, though. <laughs> These guys just come in from fishing. Let's see what they got. Oh, he's done a uh, odors uh, of yeah, odors of the Delta, I guess you could say, of well, what's cooking on Sunday odors. afternoon. Uh, Y'all gonna be cooking these fish here soon, I know, you know. Uh, what else you got? We got some uh, empty beer cans. <laughs> might be smelling empty beer left. cans. <laughs> okay, guys, this looks good. Appreciate it. All right, everybody, we picked up another scent, okay? We're moving in here, okay? Now, this is going to be, I, I saw the smoker. Yep. Yeah, that is a smoker, right? Absolutely. Okay. I saw the smoker cooking out back. That's what drew me to this area. Okay? Absolutely. So, uh, now, what are we going to make? We're just making, uh, we're going to do a little hamburger. Okay, hamburger, that's a popular thing. A lot we of might people put a little Konica sausage on the grill. Kind of concern. Yeah, that's the daddy. You know, you just gotta have. It's always got to be in your refrigerator. Okay. Always got to okay. be in your refrigerator. I like that. I like so what that. we're gonna do is we're gonna get a little. Uh, my secret is ranch. We're talking dressing. secret ranch. Okay. It just keeps it moist. You just kind of. Okay. And it, you can't be too uh, too measured out. You just gotta. Ooh. Yeah, it looks good. 
<laughs> it is, it's good, right? I like it. You put too much in there? I like it. An egg? A little egg just to bind it up. Okay. And then we're going to do a little Worcestershire sauce. Oh, whoosh, man, that's good. You how, know. Do we, how do we say whoosh? My mom, my, my wa mom and my wife, everything they use, they put either sour cream, Philadelphia cream, cheese, whoosh, you oh, know. You're right. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So we'll do that. Okay. A little salt and pepper, a little country bobs layer. Now, this is a simple hamburger. Absolutely. <laughs> You know, we we did a shoot on a hamburger a minute ago, and they said the secret was in the bun. Well, you know, we're going to do, yeah, ar you know, around here, slim pickings, but we're just going to do just a little Kaiser roll. Okay. You know? That's good. That's good. I'm now, working. I'm a little oh. dainty, so I like to put little gloves on. Oh, man, my come on. Give me a break. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, absolutely. Okay. Well, I, got this pink, is good. I got a pink shirt on. Come this on. This is now. good. Come on. It's okay. If you're brave enough to wear a pink shirt in the Mississippi Delta, it's okay. Okay. So you do some ham work there. Yeah. You know, back when I was raised on a plantation and, and this black lady, I called her my black mama, you know, she cooked for me and boy, she, you know, she didn't use any gloves and I think that's what made the food so you good. You know, that sweat and that blood and the oh, tears, man. you know? <laughs> So yeah, now the trick is, okay. you, know, you gotta, you gotta after you get it done, you put it in the refrigerator, and then you put the seasoning on afterwards. Okay. That's my trick. Okay. Now, okay. does it taste good? I think so. Uh, but. I bet you did. Now the one thing that I, you know, we also do, we do inside out burgers around here too. Inside out. Come on, give me, a, give me a hit. What is that? You about? want to see an inside out burger? Yes, please. All right, hold on. We're gonna get a little. Uh, let's see. Get some bacon. A little bacon, let's see. Let me get around here now. You're blocking my shot. Okay, right. okay, okay. Rip it up a little bit. Okay. Okay. Now, here's the trick. You get just a little bit. Yeah, little bit it helps you if you wipe your nose there. Yeah, too. absolutely. <laughs> that's, that's the flavor, my man. That's the flavor. I love it. Okay, now wait a minute. What are you going to do with the bacon? Hold on, you'll see. You're putting the bacon in the middle? Yep. You know, that's not the first time uh, I got a guy that works with me, and he said his wife puts the bacon in the middle. My uh, wife likes blue cheese, just anything and everything. In the middle? Yep, onions, peppers, anything and everything. Inside out burger. I'm with you. I'm with you. Okay, man, appreciate <laughs> it here. We got to move on. We got a lot of pits to make. It all looks good. Thank okay, everybody, I found a new scent. I got a new scent coming up, okay? Okay, we look at here. Okay. Hamburger. Hangover hamburger. Hangover hamburger. They have pepper jack cheese. You make them on Monday. In the middle of them. Okay, tell me, tell me your secret. What we got going? Here? It's um, hamburger meat, onions, honey, garlic powder, red pepper. Okay. With pepper jack cheese in the middle. Okay. Now, uh, I ran I across what's called an inside out hamburger a minute ago, okay, where the man made a patty with special sauces and then he put bacon in the middle of it, it okay, bacon. and then another patty on top of it and called it an inside out burger. Mm -hmm. Well, pretty much. We can't touch these. Oh! Okay, it's all good. Stirred with your own hands. What I'm talking about, this They're man clean. a minute ago, he had plastic gloves on. I told him, hey, he said, you know, it's, whatever. It's just, that was a, that was a. He must have, he must not have been too that was a right <laughs> Okay, that was a okay, now these are called what? Hangover hamburgers. Hangover hamburgers. Will they cure a hangover? Hell yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. All right, this all looks good, guys. Okay, we got a roll. Thank you. Okay, y'all, I smelled another barbecue pit. Let's see what we got on here. Okay. Okay. What do you what do you, what do you got on here? Come talk to me. You don't have to be on here. Ooh. So. Okay. Okay. What do we got? Pork tenderloin. Okay. Sliced down the middle. Uh huh. With uh, cream cheese, okay. jalapeno peppers. Uh, okay. Wrapped in bacon. Oh, okay. Okay. And, and then just a couple of little pork chops since so I had the grill chops. going. Yeah, boy. Oh man. That smells so, so good. Okay, well, thank you, baby. Okay, here we are. I smell, saw some colds, a cold starting, okay? So we're moving in. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got going on, okay? We're cooking a steak. 
Okay, that's a very nice piece of meat. Okay, we're gonna have a little old charcoal pit here thing going on. He's got his, his coals. Now I notice you have your coals starting in that because I bet you don't like lighter fluid. That's right. That's right. And I'm the same way. I like that little charcoal can starter thing there. Okay, now uh, the the meat. What kind of special spices you got on? I there? love Dale seasoning. And I put Dale's on it and let yeah. it marinate yeah. in it. And yeah. But I love garlic salt. And so oh, garlic yeah. salt and black pepper and Dale's is all I put on mine. Okay, now I know some people like to bring it out at room temperature for a while and, and let it breathe and whatnot. And then after they cook it, they let it breathe. You, what do you do there? I don't. I just I keep mine frozen until mm -hmm. I get ready to cook. Okay, okay. And I just I start thawing it out, and that way it soaks up that Dale seasoning oh, while yeah. it's thawing. It's hard to beat Dale's. Yeah, I like that. And I like mine pink on the inside, so with it being frozen, yeah. it don't cook as fast yeah, on the inside. Yeah. You know, I had some buffalo meat cooked here a while back with Dale seasoning on it. Have you ever had any buffalo? No. Oh, I'm that's the first time I've ever had any buffalo in Lord, Let me tell you, it's really good. Okay, man, it all looks good. We're moving on. Okay, everybody, uh, looks like the day was good. Looks like we saw a lot of good things cooking. I hope uh, maybe somebody picked up a good tip that they can use on the barbecue pit sometime. I know we smelled a lot of good food and uh, had a lot of good Southern hospitality. So, uh, for now, it's all over, and uh, we're looking forward to the next time. Appreciate it a lot. See you.